What I found behind this 142 year old door is going to amaze you. Let me show you. We're going to go out to my shop and I want to show you what I found. I'm Marv from Marv Six at Shop. I've been messing around with junk for 50 years. Old time wiring. After, uh, that old store started out with gas, like I had said, and then it ended up with uh, electric. And back in those days, they had a type of electrical system that was call, called knob and tubing. And the other day I was down there in that basement and I came across all of this knob and tubing wiring. And I want to show you what I have here. It's full of old porcelain light fixtures. I found this one previously. I've shown that to you. But we've got circuits. And just all kind of stuff in there. This would have hung from the ceiling. Can even still see the paint where this here was up in that old hardware ceiling. I'm not sure why all of this stuff intrigues me, but the box is full. And I want to share with you, some of it's busted. So you can see this is all busted up. But there's enough here that we can uh, do something with. Hey, what's that? I didn't realize that was in there, an old metal tape measure. I'll set that over here. Uh, file handle. Those are used for stretching wire. Anyway, let's get this. Oh, what in the heck is that? Oh, I bet you put that on your feet to keep you from sliding around on the icy roads. We'll put that over here, too. And I'm not sure how I'm going to use all this stuff yet, but I want to make up a mock board to demonstrate how all of this old knob and tube wiring used to, used to work. And I hope you find that interesting because I sure do. Uh, and I want to show you here in a minute I want to show you in a minute here uh, the uh, the board that I'm going to use to put all of this together on and what I have planned and then I will get right into it I've just I'm just uncovering all kinds of things in here I don't know what some of it is oh, look at that part of an old uh, bevel square is what I call them Set that over there. Maybe I can find the rest of it somewhere. Look at that, another... Wow, that's, that's the same thing I busted. I could actually use that in the one I broke. And set that right there. Maybe we'll find... By the way, these right here were screwed together like that, and the wire went through right there. And I'm going to set that kind of stuff up in my board, and when I get it all set up, I plan to, to bring you in and show it to you. But let's get this stuff off of here. This is, this is really neat, too. It's an old light switch, and I'm almost certain that's going to work. Anyway, that's my hope. Got all this old wiring in here. I want to get it out. So I want to use some of it. Jeez. Yep. It's wiring. Look at that. Now that's, I don't know if you think it's cool, but see this old green that mounted on the ceiling. This, this mounted on the ceiling, and this, this hung down, and there's your light switch. 
I've got so much of it, I'm pretty certain I won't be able to use it all, but on my mock-up, but I want to show it to you anyway. There's, this is just a piece of wire here. Ah, now that shows you how they mocked it up on these. Isn't that unique? That would have went like that. Wow. It's, yeah, I guess. There you have it. You can see this right here mounted on the ceiling and then this would have hung down within reach so that they could turn the light on. And that's what that is. And this is full. Hey, I found me a hairbrush. Look at that. I better quit or I'll get to looking too good here. Have trouble with that sometimes. Here you go. This is what I'm talking about now. Now that one's complete, except these wires are not in too good a shape. But you can bet I'm going to try to use that. If the sparks fly, you'll see it. It's another panel. It's just several of those. Oh boy, that's, I'm not sure what that is. What in the heck is this? It had nothing to do with wiring. If anyone knows what this is, please let me know in the comments. I'll let you have a good look at it. There's some writing on there. Looks like that would have went like that and like that. I can't read it though. It says, I can't read it. Maybe you can. But uh, let me know in the comments if you have any idea what this is at all. It's got some indentations back here like it would have snapped or if it would have had a spring on it and it would have clipped in place one way or the other. I don't know what it is. Here's another light switch. Boy, that one works good. And the rest of this is just full of just odd and end porcelain type things. I stopped talking because I found something really unique. This is different than the rest of them. Uh, it's a little more dangerous too. This would have had a light hanging down too and the wires coming directly to it from somewhere and then off of it. I, that's, that's different. All of these, look how shiny that one is yet. Yep, let's get this stuff out of here. I'll just pour it out on the table. Oh. Yep, a lot of junk. Screws. Parts of... What in the heck is that? Not sure. Here's what I was looking for. This would have been an insulator. Come apart. The wires would have went right there. You can see how they went in. And this came down tight. That would have been screwed to the floor joists or whatever. And like I said, a lot of this stuff here has been broken, but there's still a lot of good parts in here. 
And what I need to do now is just go through it and see what I have. Here's another one of those insulators. There's the screw. It was left right in it. Um, do you think how hard it would have been to screw these things into the hardwood with a slotted screwdriver like that? Well, there I have everything somewhat laid out. And as you can see, there's a lot of stuff there. I've already explained these, so I don't need to do that anymore. These are just steel couplers that would have held the rigid conduit. I've showed you this. I've also showed you these lights, which is at least one of them, but in the box and everything sorted out, I found three. I found two of these. They're kind of unique. I've never seen anything like it before. I'm not quite a hundred percent sure how they work or even what they're for. This right here is different. It has this screwed on there and it looks to me like a cord would have come out here and a light hang from it. I'm not sure how that would have worked unless it was this one right here which it very well could have been. Would have been something like that. Or, I, I don't think it was these because they, and it may not have been that one. I don't know, why is there a switch here? And why would you uh, have a switch on these yet? And so I don't know that. But you can see this stuff here. I found a couple of these like I've shown you and, and also uh, the, this was quite unique. So we'll get to that. And then those are all lights over there. You can see those. And then I have a little extra wire. But let me show you what I have intended for you with all of this. I mounted this panel, plan to bring wire down and show you how it was attached a couple of different ways. I've actually got three. I'll mount one of those little circuits. I'll bring some boards out and hang some lights. I did come across something pretty unique and I want to show it to you uh, right now. E.T. Phone home, E.T. Phone home, and that look like E.T. Oh, oh, that's not E.T. For Pete's sakes, that goes up top there. I'll show you how I'm going to put it on. This is going to mount in here, like that. And then I'll bring wires through and put them in there so you can see how the wires would have come to that box. But don't that look like ET to you? Well, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to mock that all up there. If you have anything you want to share with me, I'd appreciate hearing from it. If you like my videos, please subscribe. If you like videos like this, watch these right here. I do a lot of this kind of junk. And as I've said in the past, here we go. Can it be fixed? You're darn right it can be fixed. Can you fix it? You're doggone right you can fix it. Until the next one.